What if all these school buses were electric? We're here at the bus department. That's not what this is called. Where are we? Why am I in this big school bus lot? Because the Los Angeles Unified School District is doing something really, really cool. They are working on electrifying their entire fleet. Rolling out this electric fleet is big news. So they invited all the big news stations and me. We currently have by far the largest electric bus fleet of any school system in America, 180 electric buses. They are silent, they have air conditioning, they are safe. The LAUSD plan is to go 100% green and electric by 2040. We are well on our way. Our buses travel 13 million miles annually, it's enough to go around the globe 520 times. Approximately 10,000 pounds of greenhouse gases per bus. So what if we can get rid of that and replace all of it times 1,300 buses? Compared to the old diesel engines and even alternative fuels like propane or compressed natural gas, electric buses are more efficient, clean, safe, and fun. And they save cash. With state and federal vouchers, uh, we are able to almost match the price of one of those old legacy buses. The benefit, however, is remarkable savings over the lifetime of the bus of anywhere between 20 to $70,000 in terms of fuel as well as maintenance. They are good for kids, they are good for the environment, and they are the next big thing available right now. One common thing, they're all yellow. We like that color. It's bright at night, it is unavoidable during the day. Some, because there is no engine noise, produce a very whimsical sound. If you hear that music, there are kids around. For one of our remarkable electric buses is in the neighborhood. We can reduce or eliminate some of the concerns parents may have about walking their children to school. Let me be very clear. Any activity associated with the school, including the bus ride from home to school and then back to the house, those are extensions of the school day and therefore they are legally protected. Our bus drivers have been trained on what to do should anyone attempt to stop their bus. This actually started back in November of 2024. Our members in LAUSD, they were getting ready for what could happen. They treat those children like they are their own. They will protect them like they are their own. And not just our bus drivers, but all LA Unified employees have been trained and all of them are stepping up and saying, not on my watch. Bus driver of the year, Rosa Quintero says it all. We are ready for the world. Oh, there's that song. I gotta test this out in part two. Let's see if we can get on the bus. There's room on the bus. If you know a student who could use a ride, check out the LAUSD app.